to Robbie Brady. He said he's a bit bored with doing the, the usual interview, so we thought we'd have a little game of pool and ch check out my talent and see how good I am against him. But he's, he told me he's a bit of a shark, so we'll see how it goes anyway as we get on. Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> There you go. So, Robbie, how's uh, how's things? How how do you feel after after Friday night's game? How do you think it went? Yeah, I feel fine. Uh, recovered anyway for the game tomorrow. But like I said, I think uh, it might have killed a little bit us scoring so early the other night. And yeah. I felt as if they were uh, they had a lot of the ball then second half because we didn't really need to go chasing it. We had the the one goal lead. But uh, other than that, I think uh, I think it was a good result in the end. And well, we look we look comfortable enough defensively, didn't we? That that's got to be a, a big positive, I think, going going ahead of the Euros. You know, if if we know that we we might not have the ball at times against against some good teams, particularly against the, the Swiss of the night, didn't really create an awful lot of yeah. And that was the thing I thought we, we were comfortable, particularly as a back four. Yeah, that's it. I think like the last few games, especially being able to keep clean sheets and is is obviously a good sign going into going into the tournament. I think of. I think that would be half the battle if we can if we can shut up against these teams, which are expected to have a lot more of the ball. They're expected to, uh, to have a lot more of the ball, but... Without hurting us? You, 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 we, we, Without hurting us, you know yeah. what I mean? Because if we're, if we're set up in a good shape, I think, I think it puts us in good stead if we can, if we can go on and nick a goal. I think, uh, I think with the results we've had and the clean sheets we've had over the last few games, it's, it's maybe a good sign rather than a bad, mm. although we haven't had as much of the ball as we would have liked at times. It's, yeah. it's, it's still OK. I'm saying you've, 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 you've come in now, you've, you've made... Certainly, you've made a, made a statement in the side. You've, been, you've played a bit on the left-hand side of midfield. Last few games, in particular, where you've really impressed and you've been playing at left-back. So how, do you, how have you found it adjusting to play a more defensive-minded player? Uh, I, f I found it OK. I always thought that I could, I could do a job defensively over the last... I think it's just easier. more positional it's easier playing. Yeah, you know, <laughs> it's not easy, yeah, no. Just, yeah. I mean, like, trying to get your head around. But I think the side which I had to pick up, learn up quick, was positional and going off other people rather yeah. than just doing the individual job. Like, I, I'd, I'd probably prefer just to have to deal with a winger and for him against me then for the game, yeah. then that would be more me rather than then you're going to play against the likes of Chelsea and stuff like that and you haven't necessarily got someone to mark and there's people mm -hmm. running everywhere. But I think like playing with, with different, different types of defenders and different things and different centre-backs has helped me. Yeah. I sort of go off them sometimes. And so you, you say now you, you found you know, you're having to play a different sort of game, you're having to... You know, maybe you say playoff defenders and things. So how how do you find that? Because I've you know I've known of you for a long time. I've known you when you first came into Hull, and you you could play as a number ten. You could play with a bit of freedom off the wing and go and be creative. So how have you found that adjusting to being just a defender? You say one on one position. Someone's actually coming and attacking you rather than the way around. Yeah, yeah, it's been good. I think maybe I get in my head sometimes when someone's running at me, what what I do or yeah. what I think he's going to do. So I I try and think I have a decent understanding of how. Who I'm playing against? Yes. As I'm playing against them, or what type, what they like to do, and, and what I would probably do in that scenario sort of helps a little bit. But I still like, I still like attacking. Like that's that's where I like, I, I yeah, I like playing. I like playing the forward role and 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 being involved when 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 goals are being scored and when goals are being scored and and and, and sort of create a side of thing rather than like the game the other night. I, I really enjoyed it and I've yeah. been enjoying playing left back, but just sometimes I feel as if I hadn't had too much to do, you know what I mean? Yeah. And I think concentration is a, is, a, is a big part of it as well. Where do you think your best position is? Um, or should I, I don't know. I think that and say where, would you, where, would you, where would you prefer to play? I don't know, it's a hard question. I don't know where. I, I obviously maybe just nips it as probably playing more attacking yeah. because, because that's it, the way I've grown played, up and yeah. I've, yeah, yeah, I wanted I to play that, there. Yeah. The way that you've been playing, particularly with Ireland, your set pieces have become such a threat for us now. I would say, I don't want to blow your own trumpet here, but I think you've certainly become one of the best in world football now. And then when I've watched you, I've, I watch a lot of football around the world and I see you now with your deliveries. Do you think that they could be key going into... How do, how do you think about that yourself, though, you know, from a personal point yeah. of view? Like it's a big, it is a big part of football now, you know yeah. what I mean? If you can get the right men in the box, that, that's it's, the just, one thing, it's, good, it's good having people in there to hit, you know what I mean? It's all right taking, taking credit for free kicks and stuff, but uh, if I'm putting corners in so and you putting want, free kicks in... You won't take the credit for that. No, <laughs> I'm just as quick to, to get, to get <laughs> slated if I do it and overhit one or underhit one, yeah. but it's always good when you, when you see them going to the right areas. And How do you view this game tomorrow then, the Slovakians? How, how, how will you be, you know, same, same approach game. again? Same yeah. approach, I think it'll be a tough game, but... Like I said, hopefully we can, uh, 
hopefully we can have a bit more of the ball tomorrow uh, yeah. uh, at spells and, and, uh, and a good win would be good. Time, I suppose, is running out for everyone to try and make that impression on Martin, really. And yeah. sometimes it can be that frustration from, from, from all the lads' point yeah. of view, really. They're not necessarily going to shine and do the things that they're, they're naturally, naturally good at, I suppose. Yeah, it's hard. That's what, I think that's what's the hardest part is about being a, a, new, a new lad in. I think, well, I'm speaking, like you said, about like, the likes of Judger during the week. Judge has been quality all week. And I think you've done me here at the end. Uh, Judge has been... <laughs> Finish Kev. <laughs> Judge has been, uh, Judge has been class all week, so I think like everyone knows, everyone knows how, how good of a player he is. And I found it the same. Like I think my first probably three, four, five games for Ireland, I felt as if like games were passing me by yeah. and, and it was hard. And then there's like another few months. Uh, it's gonna be tough, it's gonna be tougher places obviously before before France, but like I said, the the ones who do miss out are gonna are gonna have are gonna have stuff to to look forward to in the in the in the next couple of years but yeah. obviously it's not going to be an easy one to take